Welcome to Simulator Adventures and welcome to Firefighting Simulator The Squad. Now in the past I played a game called Flashing Lights which was sort of a emergency services simulator and I kind of had this impression that a lot of firefighting games haven't been very good in the past but this one according to the Steam reviews it's got positive Steam reviews I'm really looking forward to trying this. This is going to be the first time I've ever played this game it's going to be my first impression so let's jump right in. I've got the graphics up to max on epic level in 1440p. Um, I really love having 1440p. It really has improved um, a lot of the games I play. I can't quite run 4K. 4K is still such a long way away, right, um, for a lot of people. My graphics cards just can't handle it. Anyway, we're straight in. All right. So this is uh, set in the US, apparently it's got a 15,000 acre town map, which is really cool, I mean that's a, that's a big map actually. Um, there's real licensed vehicles, we're in one of them now, I think. Okay. Okay, the police are here. Oh, that's a big fire, okay. I can't look around much. Right. Oh my. The house is destroyed already. I mean. Uh, there's an ambulance here. Yeah, you're not going to be able to salvage much from that house, are you? Maybe on this side. But the rest of the house is totally destroyed. Like, my god. Alright, so we got to go in. Or are we just going to be on the outside? Okay, okay. So... Okay, let's go, let's go. Get inside the house. I'm going, I'm going, okay. Wow, it's very smoky. A Halligan tool. Oh, break that door. Yep, okay, we're in. Oh. Okay, he's broken his leg, let's go. Well, the graphics are pretty good. I mean, that fire looks good. Um, uh, let's put him up to go on the other side and place. Okay, objective complete. Wow, okay. Grab the nozzle, right. So we have to hold E to swap to things, uh, and then I guess we just go. Oh, it might, I reckon the car started it, no? Okay, so in a similar way to Flashing Lights, which is another game I've tried, um, you have to kind of aim it at the base of the fire and then get rid of each individual kind of fire element, I guess. Let's get rid of this. There you go. So you just have to point it at that. There you go. So I could turn the graphics down a bit, but I'm getting 40 to 50 FPS at the moment. I reckon all this fire is really eating at my um, FPS. Should we be going inside? I don't think we should. I mean, th this car is like blown up, isn't it? Because of the petrol inside it. Um, there you go. Let's get rid of that. Okay. It's taken quite a while. I do remember um, Floating Lights taking quite a while though. It's like... There's a lot of different bits of fire here I need to get rid of. Um, I think you can kind of move a bit faster than I'm actually going. Yeah, there you go. I am. I have, I have grabbed the, no the nozzle. Come on. There's some more. I'm a bit worried that all this fire above me, like, I should really be doing that. Probably quicker than I'm doing right now. 
There you go. That's better. Get rid of the roof. There you go. Okay, you can kind of cover more than one bit of fire at once, actually. There you go. How much... I think we're just getting water from the fire hydrants, right? In the UK, a lot of fire trucks have to have, like, onboard water. Fire, hyd fire hydrants aren't, like, everywhere in the UK, so... I know they are in the US. Okay, our team... Our colleague is helping us. Now, let's do this stuff above. Whoa! I'm inside his head. So, I think this has got, like, a story mode or of some description. Which I like. Um, okay, the garage is out. Debriefing. First steps. We did it. Oh, yes. Whoop. And we can... Oh, we can spray the water around. Yeah! Oh, we can actually put it out as well. So, the, the rest of the house is on fire, but we saved the garage, so that's all that matters. Um, wow. I do like that I can still control myself in this <laughs> little cutscene. That's quite funny. Oh, wow. Congratulations, you've completed your first mission. You are now on the interactive city map. Here, you can select your next mission. Okay, so the next mission is already available to select. With growing experience, more will be unlocked. Before responding to your next emergency, you should sharpen your skills. No better, to, no better place to start than the training facility. You can always visit it by selecting the ICM. Do you want to take a look at the training grounds now? Yes, I do. Yeah, graphics-wise, looks really good. Oh god, um, circular saw. That sounds interesting. Got a flashlight. Okay. Pick up the circular saw from the ground. Okay. Good. Now use the saw to cut the lock on the vent ahead. You have to be careful, so aim for the indicated target. That was easy. Vent opened. Nice. Once more, pick up the saw from the Okay. Alright, so we gotta break the locks on this garage door. There's one. Here's another. Now walk over to the job Yeah. He started explaining it way too late, but I've done it. Okay. Well that was easy training. Um well, that wasn't very interesting, so maybe, like, maybe ladder trucks? Yeah, ladder this trucks. This training exercise will familiarize you with how to use ladder trucks and aerial arms to attack fires from above. Oh, yes. Elevated locations. Amazing. I want to do this. Ladder, we must first stabilize it and ensure that the truck will not tip over with the ladder boom extended. Okay. Walk over to the indicated control panels and extend all the truck's outrigger arms. Right, outrigger arms. The outrigger arms simultaneously bypass the vehicle's movable suspension and gives the truck... Okay, that's done. Right, now we've got to go to the control panel. Enter basket. Good. The ladder arm offers you three degrees of movement. Up, down, Ooh. left, right, and forward, backward. Extending Ooh. the ladder arm forward and backward effectively lengthens and shortens the length of the ladder. All right, now use the indicated controls and move the ladder in the forward and okay. backward direction. Okay, forward and backward is R and F. Yes. Oh, yes. Are we going up to the roof? Excellent. Now you're going to use the ladder arm and bucket to rescue some victims. Okay. Use the ladder arm controls and move the ladder bucket to either indicated area. Wait okay, so I can move the basket the up. You're essentially using Hold. the ladder bucket to give them an escape route. So once the victim has reached the bucket, they've moved into the safe zone and are considered safe. Yeah, you go. Oh, nice. That's cool. Yes. Woohoo! Oh, wow. Oh. Okay. Ah. Uh, Come on. Get him. There's not much sound. Not <laughs> move towards the bucket. You must place the bucket near the victim, exit the bucket, and interact oh. with the victim to get them to follow you into the bucket. Okay. The bucket has reached the indicated area and the bucket is stable on the roof. The player can exit the bucket by pressing Oops. the use key. Exit the bucket and rescue the victim by interacting with them and returning to the bucket. 
Okay, you've saved one victim. Okay. Now position the bucket near the other indicated roof and wait for the victim to reach the bucket. Yeah, but he's on the floor. I mean, okay. This victim is unconscious, so you'll have to carry them back to the bucket. Okay, makes sense. They seem okay, but they're unconscious. Okay, right. Enter the basket. Boom. Use the bucket as a way for fighting fires from above. Okay. Let's keep it going. Um. Is that okay? Move arm up. Hold on. There you go. Right. What? Oh, it does actually have switch on nozzle control. Got it, right. There you go. That makes sense now. So this is really useful, this thing. Boom. Okay. Now we're going to go over here. Can I... Will it work here? I don't really know. Let's see. Yeah, I think it'll be okay here. That's in a really tricky spot, that thing. Alright, put those out. A few more. There's three in a... And they're four in really close proximity there. Nice. And this bit. Fires are out. Yes. Congrats. Woo. Completed the fire fire Congrats. Wow. And are ready to handle any situation. So you can save as many oh, wow. Look at the water. Possible. Leaving a mark on the buildings. Wow. That's a nice detail. Well. Remember, we train today to be safe tomorrow. I've got to be honest. The rest of the tutorials, dealing with windows, fire propagation and growth speed, it sounds okay. I've, I, apart from backdrafts, I think I understand everything else. Um, so, let's just let's just move on. So, okay, there are two fires. So let's look at this map. Yeah, the map does seem quite big. There's a training facility. Downtown, Victoria Springs, Lakeview Park, the Industrial Park. Wow. Okay, so that's the introduction. We've got a new fire here, home crafting. You can uh, this game is multiplayer as well. I think you can have up to four players. Yeah, so three friends with you. Um, well, squad commands. I'm sure I'm sure I'll be fine. Right. So there's me. Oh, it's it's me. It's me and me. Okay. Uh, we're gonna try that. Yep. Yeah. Yep, okay, I think four guys. Yep, that's fine. All right, we're going to drive there. I remember there was a game. It was called like, Airport Firefighter Sim. It must be ten years ago that game's released now. It is terrible. Oh, my goodness. Games have come so far. Okay, a siren. Emergency lights. There you go. Ooh. Here we go. Um. Well, that's safe. Let's squeeze through there. Okay. So we're in Midtown. I do like the map, actually. The map seems okay. There's a massive, like, city over there. Come on. I'm going to beat him. Wow. We're doing 52, 53. Fi oh, wow. This thing's quick. People are pulling over, which is always a good sign in a game. You know that the devs have, like, forgotten something when you're in a game and you're in a police car or an emergency vehicle and nobody's pulling over. 
I can't remember any recent games have had that, but I remember playing games like years and years ago, which should, you know, have had cars pulling to the side of the road when you've got sirens on. Okay, we're in the West Tunnel. Look at this. Look at the size of this tunnel is huge. Okay. We've got one minute. Oh, no. It's counting up how much time. Okay. We're three kilometers away. Okay. So we don't know if they're actually evacuating the house or not. Whoa! I left that late to turn away. What other cameras have we got? Not much. That one and that one. I can't even see our colleague. I mean, uh, our colleagues are just gone. Oh yeah, what a cool looking truck though. Actually quite similar to some of the trucks we have here in the UK. It's a bit longer. Like, the back bit is identical, but the front bit we wouldn't have quite as big a cab as that, I don't think. Whoa. Uh oh. Left turn. Yes, put the signal on. Ooh, there's a truck there, okay. Tell you what, the, um, you can see the smoke, okay. The truck leans quite a lot when you go around the corners. I suppose that's to be expected. Now, moment of truth. Have I made a mistake not doing all the tutorials? Okay, here we go. Uh, I'm not in the parking area. Oh, is that the parking area? No, where's the... What traffic is here if I hit? Did I just hit that guy? I went too far. I just hit that guy, didn't I? I like that statue outside. Look at that. Why is that statue? Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, we've just got the lowdown. Let's go and save some lives. Alright. Look at this look at this statue. Anyway, me too stuff. Right, fuse box, fuse box. Um Oh okay. Smash the windows, but I'm not going in there. Uh breach, I'm missing the tool. Where is the fuel box where is the, the um fuse box? Fuel box. Fuse box, okay. Well, I'm not going through there. Did he say where the fuse box was? Okay, rear bedroom, rear bedroom. That's an air conditioner. Right, no, the fuse box must be inside, okay. Um, what's... Don't know what that is. Right, okay. Let's get some tools. Hoses inside. Uh... Axe inside. I spelled axe wrong, but you know, whatever. Right, we're going to break down the door. Right. Um, I've got a tool. Hold on. I can do it. Right, so. Attack fire shortcut. You, attack fire. Okay, so I've got to get down. Because... Uh, flashlight, flashlight, there you go. Hello, how are you okay? Always well, meant to keep down in a, in a fire. I've actually got respirator gear on, so I'm probably okay. Um, let me come for the water. There you go. Yep, right. 
Okay, bring him to the, um... Oh, it's a girl, actually. A woman, I mean. I swear they said a man. I don't know. I think they just said survivor. It must be my, my, my imagination. <laughs> okay. There you go. Right. Turn off the electricity. Well, it, I reckon it's going to be in the garage, right? Oh my... He's got gold. Okay. Uh... Hazards. Don't let the fire spread to them. Yes, good point. Right. Uh... Why has he got all these gold statues of dinosaurs? Okay, never mind. Right, flashlight. Where the heck would a fuse box be? Well, I'll close that door. Aha! Boom. Quench all fires. I think we're nearly done. Um... You see the... Yeah. Right. Can I pick up another hose? I think I can. Remove cap. Remove cap. Equip supply hose. Um, connect attack line. There you go. And I need the... I need the... Uh, what do you call it? The... Uh, what are you doing walking down here? <laughs> okay, equip null. Okay, you see? I know how to... Do oh, nearly. Couple. There you go. I know how to play sim games. I mean, I probably should have done the tutorials. I, that took me longer than it should have, really. Um, and now, you know, it's taking quite a while to, fit, to fight this fire. Anyway, let's get down. Continue going. Yep, yeah, yep, yep. Right, I'll get the, the ceiling. Oh, let me go over here. Well, sorry about your sofa. Not much we can do there. I'm going to do this. Whoa, okay, that... I, yeah, probably should have done that corner first. Or we were about to die. Um, I think you can die. Fast mission time expired. Well... You know, it's my first mission, that's okay. I should have told these guys to fight the fire much earlier. Oh, we're breaking all of the cabinet stuff because of the water. Uh, that's not good. Is it me or does it sound like the fire's getting louder? Okay. Whoa. At least the um, golden dinosaur collection is fine. Ah, uh, being sprayed water. I think the guy behind me is spraying water at me. Okay, I should probably do the tutorial that's like the best way to extinguish a fire, because I might be aiming at the wrong point of the fire, maybe. Yeah, I should be starting at the bottom, shouldn't I, really? Um. Nearly done. Oh, we did it. Well done, team. Well done. So I can... I just... That's the com that's the command, like, wheel. Okay, that's pretty cool. The lights shouldn't work, should they? No. Oh. Well. We just saved a man's... Dinosaur collection. That's a uh, good day's work. <laughs> kind of makes it quite cinematic, doesn't it?
all these camera angles and things. Bandana hatches, burning news, I just got three achievements in one go. You can't see those because my recording doesn't pick it up. But I got Firefighter Rookie, you saved my life in TP3 driver. That must be the build, not the building, the vehicle I was in. All right. Um, any new fires? So new mission is that one. Okay. I've done that. Should we do one more? I'm, I want to do one downtown. Burning news. Okay, one more mission. Then drive that. See, I, I do want to do um, multiplayer, but I don't know anyone that has this game. Um, if you do have this game, actually come over to my Discord server. That'd be good. There's a link in the description. It's a great place to come and talk to me about games and suggest games for me to play. And also, there's monthly giveaways, so it's really cool. Um, right. Emergency lights on. Siren on. Headlights on. Let's go. Get out of the way. Wow, oops. Come on, we're the fast response unit. You're the slow response unit. Actually, downtown isn't so far away from our base, so... Okay. Oh my god, we nearly tipped over. Right. It's quite a big city, lots of tall buildings. I like that they've actually put effort into the map on this. You can tell it's like a quite a nice world. I played a few games in the past year, not necessarily simulator games, I'm not naming any names, but where the cities for a triple A game do not feel good. And this actually feels better than some of those. And this is like a you know, just a simulator game. And simulator games aren't always known for their amazing maps, right? Okay. Yeah, feels good from what I've seen so far. Ooh. Game's a bit stuttery. That might be to do with my high graphics options. And also the fact I'm recording, but it's not too bad. Okay. It's a newspaper stand. Whoa, what was... I've hit somebody. Uh-oh. Why are you standing there? Why are they standing there? Okay, right. I don't know if there's anyone inside. I mean, I'm guessing there's not. Okay, we get it. Right. Okay, control wheel. Um, equip and follow attack line. Okay. They're doing it, they're doing it. Right, I'm going to get a supply hose as well. Remove the cap. Um, equip. Connect. Equip nozzle. Connect. Right. Can we get any more people? Uh, should I be inside, really? I'll go on the other side. There you go. I feel like I should go, like, to the door. And try and fight the fire from the inside. Okay, fast mission timer has been expired. Um, but we're doing an okay job, actually. I think this will be out very soon. So obviously not like a massive building fire. Oh, and we're only just shy of the um, mission time. Anyway, we did it. Wow. That was a good quick mission. And there I go with the hose again. Wow, that's so cool. Oh, wow, the water effects. Okay. Um, driving time. Medium. Challenge bonus 500. Nice, be leveled up. Um, we can go back to the menu, we can look at my overall progress and XP. I'm guessing that you unlock vehicles um, later, but I will be doing some more of this in the future. There's a couple of new missions that are here in Lakeview Park, 
Um, anything else in downtown? I don't know. I, I want to see. I want to do like a massive building fire. That'd be cool. Maybe some more training. Maybe we'll do some more training next time. We'll probably do one more part of this. I might do some live streams or any more. Let me know if you want to see. Um, maybe this turn into a series. I don't really know. Um, yeah, I think that. I think you just progress. Um, I don't know. I, I expected there to be like a shop or something where you could buy um, trucks, new trucks or new equipment. But I don't think there's actually any money related to this game. It's all about XP. But yeah, um, yeah. Once fill that, more missions and rewards will be unlocked. Fair enough. So yeah, that was um, Firefighter Simulator: The Crew or the Squad. Actually, the Squad. Um, I really, really enjoyed it. I think I'm going to be doing at least one more video on it, and I'll see you soon for some more Simulator. Adventures. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to see more content from my channel and check out these videos to see more simulation gaming on Simulator Adventures.